sunrise over ancient Ur. It is midsummer, and the day will be scorchingly hot. Slowly, the city comes to life. People slept on their rooftops, which were much cooler at night than the small rooms of their houses. Ancient texts listing real estate sales show that the house's floor space was less than 70 square meters. In the early morning, people come onto the streets. Merchants try to entice the passers-by. They try to do business while the day is still cool. In the courtyards of some houses, men relax and drink beer through straws. Several ancient texts refer to the Sumerian temperament. The Sumerians' exposure to the hazards of nature made them conscious of the brevity and fragility of life. In the streets, men often wear konaks, wrap-around sheepskin skirts that go from the waist to the knees or ankles, depending on the season and fashion. The wives of dignitaries wear colorful, lighter garments. Both men and women wear jewelry, earrings, bracelets, and necklaces. Archaeologists have discovered that forgers operating in the walled city could replicate gold and turquoise. People who couldn't afford real jewelry could buy and wear fancy fakes. This neighborhood was home to merchants, shopkeepers, and traders. The homes of the scribes, masons, and carpenters, and the slaves' houses were all within a short distance of the temple. <laughs> 